Hey Lightweights, and welcome back to some more Bloodborne. All right, so, um, as I was editing the last video, I am recording this before that the last video is posting. So I'm sure a lot of you are gonna say this in the comments. So I apologize if I've already responded this to you in the comments, but I'm gonna say it again for those who didn't see it because people typically don't read my responses to other people's comments. Anyways. As I was editing the last video, I just, I felt like I rushed through everything and I didn't fully explore. Like as I was editing, there was like, I think, I don't even remember how to get there, but that one windmilly thing where I fell to the ground, there was like a doorway. And I don't know if that's the doorway I came in or if that's the doorway that went outside that I fell down off of. I don't remember, I fell a lot in that freaking windmill. But anyways, so I wanna go back there just to make sure that wasn't a new path. I wanted to go back to the village cause I feel like I fell in the hole and then I got all turned around there. Um, obviously I need to explore the area with the snake heads because I just ran through that. I just booked it. <laughs> so I'm sure there's a lot of stuff there that I forgot. I think I was brushing because I was just panicking because it was very stressful and I just didn't like it. Like the snake head area in particular. The other area I think I just was getting turned around and I kept falling off of ledges and it was just confusing me. But anyways, I think that's the plan for today. I want to go back and I really want to like take my time with those areas and make sure <laughs> that I've explored them. Specifically like not necessarily, I feel like I did a good job with like that canyon leading up to the town. I don't need to go back there. I think I, well, I'm sure I missed something, but I feel like I did a more thorough job there. But more specifically like the town and then that windmill. Um, which I don't even remember if that was before or after the town. Fuck, I don't know. I don't know. I'm just going to go back and redo that stuff. Um, I might end up cutting a lot of it out. So if it's like much more jumpy in the final video that's why but i just want to make sure that i didn't miss anything and give it the time that it deserves because i do have a tendency when i'm feeling stressed to just rush 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 uh, and i don't want to do that with the game so i want to go back make sure that i have everything maybe this is pointless and maybe i'll go back and i'll realize there wasn't really anything there so it might be like oh just kidding but i want to try and if it's jumpy you know it's because i cut a lot out um but we'll play and play by ear. And then I also figured that would be good for me to like reacquaint myself with the area because I don't even know how to get back to the bosses anyways. So I'm hoping that when I'm going through those previous areas and reacquainting myself with them, it will remind me like where the bosses are and stuff like that. Um, so I'm just going to make peace with the fact that I'm probably not going to get those blood echoes that I lost for the bosses. My initial thought was maybe I just go fight the bosses and then I go back, but like I said, I don't really remember how to get there, so I feel like it's probably a moot point anyways. Um, okay, I have a whole lot of nothing right now. So yeah, that's kind of what I'm thinking. <laughs> oh, because also when I was editing, I figured this is why I was thinking the town, I missed stuff. Because that bridge where they were chucking Molotovs at me when I was like in that river, I'm thinking that I probably have to get to that bridge from the town. So there's probably like a path up in the town that I missed. Um, and that's why I was thinking the town specifically. And then the windmill because I thought I saw a doorway but I also fell so I don't know if I actually missed a doorway or if that was the doorway that I had fallen previously. <laughs> you guys are like, okay, shut up and just start going. So... I think if I go straight, that'll take me to the town. And then, where did this even... Shit. Not how you want to start. Oh, I forgot about that guy. I wonder... He said I could summon people... With his little guildy guild thing. I wonder if, um... Do I summon them for the bosses? I just want to see where this goes, because I don't remember. And then I might go just, like, over that bridge. Because I think the town can be that bridge. Okay, what is this exactly? 
so this is the snake area. So where is that other elevator that I went? Hmm. Okay. So this is probably pretty close to the faucet. Oh, that's the windmill thingy. Okay, wait, this is actually perfect. And then I think maybe I can backtrack from... This. To the town. I think there was a guy down here. Oh shit, you know what I need to do? Oh, I forgot I have all these frenzied cold blood shit. <laughs> Oopsie daisies. I just get so stressed out. I thought there was a guy down here. Oh, this guy's all snakeified. I would prefer not to have to fight him as a Oh, he's not sneaky. Why does it sound like he's sneaky? Can I sneak up on him? Ah, oh, shit, no. I was just wailing at him because I was trying to get him down before the snakes popped up, but obviously that didn't work. Okay, so don't ask me where that this was this the door is. No, that's where I fell. Right? I think that's where I fell. I fell so many times though. I don't even know. Let's just go up and start from the top. Oh, this is the top. Okay. So that must have been the doorway I saw, and I definitely went that way. So. Although there is up higher. This must have been the doorway I was thinking of. Let's just jump down here and see if there's. I thought there was more to the windmill than this. Oh, right, because there was a ladder. I'm just gonna leave this guy, I think. Ow! Damn! Is he gonna follow me, though? Shit, I guess I should've killed that guy. He took way more damage on than I was anticipating. Are you gonna follow me up? Yep! Shit. This is definitely not how you want to start this campaign. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. So I did this. What's this? Is this the doorway? Maybe this is the doorway I saw. Okay. I didn't go here. I can't lock onto that guy. Is he fucking eating those people? Why can't I lock onto him? He's eating oh. that kid! Blimey. Don't scare me like that. On a night like this, I took you for a monster. Oh, thank the stars. You took me for a monster? On. Was it you who put down that awful beast? Ooh, that thing had me trembling, frozen in my boots. And then you came along. 
Well, if you're a hunter, then would you know of any safe havens? I'm not sending you there, you cannibal. Well, I'll be. Thank you. It's about time I made a move. I can't very well stay out on my own. Oh, you're giving me hope. Terribly kind of you. Take this. It's all I can offer us, thanks. Listen, I hope Yosefka does some awful experiments on you. Because even if these people are already dead, you're fucking... You just... You can't be doing that, sir. That's a no-no. That is a no-no. Okay. Okay. So now if I go... I want to go to the town, but if I backtrack this way, that's kind of going to be a nightmare. Isn't it? I'm just trying to think of what's the best way to do this. I mean, I guess I don't have to bite the people in the house. And I could just run. This is probably fine. I just won't fight the people in the houses. And then I'll just run past the river. Because I think I unlocked a shortcut there. Well. We've already made our peace with losing our shit. We gotta stick to that. This is gonna be fine. This is gonna be fine, because this is the shortcut, right? Nice. This guy's following me all the way here? Really? Wow, you are motivated, sir. So, am I in the town now? <laughs> this is like, again, I'm confused. When I was editing, I was like, oh yeah, I missed that. Oh yeah, I missed that. But when I'm playing it, I'm like, what is up? What is down? Where is everything? All right, this is... I just want to get to the gate. All right, here's the gate. Oh my god. Hold on. Hold on! That was a gate. I came up this way. Because then I think I jumped down and there may, I don't know. I'm just trying to think of like, if I had to take a high path to that bridge, where would that be? And I'm assuming, what's that? I definitely didn't go that way. Okay, let's just kill these doggies. Might as well get the blood echoes. He's out here. That's a path there. Hmm. That's the wrong way, though. But we do need to remember that because we definitely need to go check that out. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, quick, quick. There's a. Okay, let's just see what this is. Hi, Birdie. Roosting up on this roof. White church hat, white church garb, white church trousers. Oh god, there's another one. Oh god, there's another, another one. Okay, let's 
see what those are. Because we have the church garb on right now, don't we? Ooh. Burr. Oh, the black church garb. So what's the difference? 30, 40, 40, 60, 21 slow poison, 18 rapid poison. So this is more damage reduction. 2019. This is better slow poison, worse damage. 63, 55, 80, 81, 10. 6058. So it seems like this is just better for that slow build poison, which could be good in the snake area. Although I wish I could mend the two, blend the two together because I need fast and slow poison. <laughs> but for this area, I think I'm just going to keep this on because I've got more physical, like, I don't need to worry about poison quite yet. Oh. Hi. Okay. There were only two cages open, so that means there's only two doggies. Just gonna get this guy. Just click on him. Gravy. Then I can't open it again. <laughs> okay. So I definitely didn't do this. That makes me feel better. I'm glad this wasn't a total waste of time. I definitely have to go to Yusufka's clinic too and check on that guy. Oh my god, no, no, no! 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 How did you know I was in here? Oh, 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 shit. Ah! There's that, at least. <laughs> okay. Anyways. What was I doing? <laughs> you made me lose my train of thought, bag boy. What did I get from there? I got something from there. Let me see what that was. Uh, it looked like a rune or something, maybe. like a claw, didn't it? Shit, what did I get? <laughs> what did you give me? <laughs> Was it the beast room thing? Oh, no, no, beast roar. What is this? Once one of the forbidden hunter tools made by the irreverent Izzy. Borrow the strength of the terrible undead dark beasts, if only for a moment, to blast surrounding foes back with the force of a roaring beast. The indescribable sound is broadcast with the caster's own vocal cords, which begs the question, what terrible things lurk deep within the frames of men? So what is this? A weapon? Arcane. Oh, it uses bullets. Arcane 15. So it is a weapon. Huh. OK. 
Okay. So I got that. That was the gate that I... Okay. This is it! See? I had a feeling. I love how that counted as a jump attack. So I want to make sure that I didn't miss anything. That's a lot of blood going down the side of the building. Did this guy have loot? Nope. Okay. Alright. <laughs> Tell me there's nothing up here for me to worry about coming up here anyways. <laughs> there already. That is a little pathy. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay, how do I get that? Um, carefully. Oh, wait, is that oil? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Okay, Molotovs. So what if I just... Highly effective. What is this bone marrow ash that I just used? It's singing like an angelic tune. <laughs> Okay. Now, that was totally not worth it. I built that bridge up in my head. I thought there's going to be more up there. <laughs> I just got Molotovs that I just wasted all of anyways. Um, I want to go check out that one path that I saw. But I think I'm just going to run past your guys here because I just honestly don't give a fuck. I don't give two fucks about them. They really are upset by me being here. Get off my line! Alright, now these are... Okay, good. Still dead. Maybe this is a different shortcut. That would be very nice. Although these kind of look like those... Uh... These look like those alien things. Probably shouldn't. Probably shouldn't do that. It's probably not the smartest. Probably not the smartest move. I'm sure there's something down there, but we can come back. It's gonna be the the phrase of this playthrough. Eh, we can come back. <laughs> so if this is gonna be, sorry, as I broke the microphone. If this is gonna be the um. What's the word I'm looking for? It's like the alien area. Oh god, what are those things? 
this is gonna be the alien area. That means I'm back in the poison zone. So let's try this. Let's just see the difference here if I notice one. And we only have two added eye. This is not that area. Okay. See over there. I'm kind of nervous. Oh, this guy's not gonna lie. This guy looks like maybe I can. Don't ask me why I'm not running in the water. Oh my, oh my god! Okay. Well, I guess that's why I'm not running in the water. That was unintentional, but shit, this is, oh my god. What the fuck are you? Oh. I can't hit it! I can't hit it! This is, I don't like this area. Oh, he's coming. I can't get out. I didn't mean to do that. Oh no. I thought I saw the. <laughs> Good golly. All right, well. There's definitely more to explore there, but I am not doing that until I have more fucking antidote. Oh my god. What? No! I didn't mean to use my antidote that time. <laughs> I was trying to jump. <laughs> and I forgot how. What's on my face? I literally just said, I'm not gonna explore till I have antidote. And I'm like, eh, maybe I'll go get that thing right there. Okay, but the rest of it, I'm sure there's more, but I'm not gonna do that till I have antidote. For real, for real, for real, for real. Okay, please tell me I can get out this way. Please tell me. Look at all these bodies. It probably smells delicious. Just on that one guy here. You get to have a feast. So long as ladder. Their heads look funny. I guess they look normal. They looked like really large. the hell am I? Okay, so there's a doorway over there. Oh shit! Wait! This is the beginning of the game! Well, 
might as well run to Yosefka's clinic real quick. I'm very grateful that they didn't have that um, werewolf respawn after you killed it the first time. And then, after I go to Yosefka's clinic, I think I'm gonna go back to the Hunter's Dream. Before I explore that one path that was back there. Um, Cause I think I might be able to level up. Oh, hello. You're all right. Very good. She's safe with me now. I presume you're to thank. The treatment is going well, stabilized. For the most part. Fascinating, really. Here you are, as promised. Oh, thank goodness you came. Be a dear. Find me some more. <laughs> Listen. If I find any more sketchy cannibals, they're all yours, honey. <laughs> My gift to you! <laughs> Okay, so we're gonna go back, because I have a lot of cold blood I can use. So even if I can't level, I'll use some of those, and then I'll level up. And then I feel more comfortable exploring. Welcome home. What is it you... Very well, let me... Okay, I can. Let's see. Then I only need 16,000, so I might as well... Farewell, may you... I wish I could just go into my inventory from that menu. Might as well use some of these, because since I only need 16,000 to level up again, I might as well do that. I think you guys said that the Frenzied is the same as just the regular. Oh, that was perfect! Welcome that was literally the perfect the amount! Very well. Let the echoes be let me and I wish there was something that would like <laughs> improve my poison. For the cannon. Farewell, good hunter. I want to try that. All right, let's repair. I don't think I have anything I can fortify, anyways. Oh, and I want to try to buy. <laughs> I definitely am not going to have enough blood echoes. 1300. I think I'm going to use some cold blood and I'm going to get those. Because I freaking need them. I need them! Desperately! Let's do three. That was kind of one that I wanted to use, but... I never know how much it's gonna give me. But I guess if they're 1300 a pop, that's really not that many. This is such a fucking waste. But I need them! So we're gonna get him. You know, I could be using the shining coins and leaving myself a path. <laughs> oh, I miss this area. I miss this area a lot. It's amazing how they do that. Like, this first area felt so challenging. And now I'm like, I want it back! <laughs> okay, so we got this gate. Watch, there be nothing here. There's stairs. I 
I'm losing my mind. I definitely thought I saw somebody hiding over here. Okay. The game is getting to me. Oh, shit. Trust these blanks? That's a lot of frickin' birds. right now. <laughs> Where is this in relation to the first area? Okay. Just get an insight. Um. <laughs> what is this? What are they doing here? Um, alien, this is not your home. That you're in the wrong spot. This is the wrong zone. Blood vial acquired from the lady doctor at Yosefka's clinic. This refined blood, highly invigorating, restores a larger amount of HP. This rare blood vial is a product of a slow and careful refinement process, likely devised by the doctor herself. So this is like this. So does that mean this is Yosefka? Bitch, I just talked to you. What happened to you? What? Handwritten scrawl. Seek pale blood to transcend the hunt. <laughs> Yosef is an alien? So how many? F That's a lot of f fingers. I don't fucking understand what is happening. Kanehurst summons. An old bloodstained summons inviting an honored guest to the forsaken castle Kanehurst. Rather bafflingly, it is addressed to you. Do not hesitate. The stagecoach leaves from Hemwick Crossing. So this is...
Where was the bed from that first cutscene where we were in with the little guys that the lanterns saved us? Was that in here? I already don't remember. They're just a little odd. How do we go from fighting werewolves and big furry monsters to taking on an alien invasion? I'm... Okay. Just a little confused by the story. <laughs> Like, what is... What is going on, exactly? <laughs> Alright, that was a beast, right? Oh, I already have one. Wait. Shit. This one am I two. How do I have two of these? Oh, this one's better. Okay. Where's the cannibal guy? Are they being turned into these things? Look, look, that's a human hand. So those aren't even al those aren't aliens. This is like a parasite or something. So is Yosefka? Well, no, because if Yosefka is one of the <sighs> my brain hurts. So either Yosefka was turning the people into these things, and that's why they're walking in the halls. But if that one that was that had Yosefka's blood was Yosefka, which is what I'm assuming because it had her blood. I don't know why I would have her blood if it wasn't her. Then that means we've got an intruder! <gasps> we want that on. We really want that on. Tempted to go back and just put that on and then come back, but I don't want these guys to be back here. I just really want to know what their heads feel like. Like, are they filled with liquid? And it's like a water balloon? Or, you know those things that were really popular in the early 2000s? <laughs> they were like those, they are filled with water, they, it's... <laughs> and you can't hold on to them, they have like rubber, like... It looks like inappropriate, but they had like water in them and like plastic and you couldn't hold it and they would like squeeze out of your hand. Does it feel like that? Or does it feel like a water balloon? I, okay. Ah, moonlit scents. How did you worm your way in here? Very unfortunate. I had such high hopes for you. Well, I won't make any excuses. Would you mind leaving us alone? Things need not change. You'll do the rescuing, and I'll do the saving. But if you refuse to leave... Oh, well. I've always wanted to try my hand on a hunter. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Okay, so that's not Yosefka. <laughs> this is Yosefka. 
Who's Yosefka? <laughs> what is Yosefka? Why is Yosefka? Also, this sounds like a boss fight. I don't know if I want to do that right now. Not sure I have that in me at this moment. Although I do only have 6,000 blood echoes, so... Probably a good time to try. Although I'm not fully up on my blood... Vials. I could always do a little bit of this, though. Alright, I just want to see... I've got a poison knife. I could use that. That always works well for me. Strengthens quicksilver bullets. See, I don't know if that's going to be helpful right now. I don't really have anything else, though, so... Lightning? I could try that. Prevents HP restoration. That could be good. She's a doctor, so I'm going to go out on a limb here and say... Maybe she can heal. Eh. We're gonna try it. It's only 16. It's only 6,000. It's not that big a deal. We lost way more than that to the shadows! There's something in the shadows. Where is she? Giving me away! I'm trying to be stealthy! Okay, that's a wall there, so she's not gonna be there. I want to fight her up there. I'd rather fight her in the open. Ah! She's got a gun. I don't think that fucking did anything to her. Oh my god. Maybe I shouldn't have wasted the Yosaka vial on that. But, meh. <laughs> oh, what did I just get? It looks like a rune. Writhe sees a subtle mucus in the warmth of blood and acknowledges visceral attacks as one of the darker hunter techniques. Visceral attacks restore quicksilver bullets. Human or no, the oozing blood is a medium of the highest grade and the essence of the foremost great one, Odin. Both Odin and his inadvertent worshippers surreptitiously seek the precious blood. 
grants two bullets. Visceral attacks grant two bullets. Interesting. Ooh, that seems like it's helpful. Also, those fucking, these did nothing. fire paper but all right well i'm kind of glad i did that just now she really did not give me many blood echoes though does she count as a boss maybe like a mini boss she's easier than a hunter i'll give her that although she almost had me for a second there there's literally nothing up here she was kind of pointless <laughs> i guess if you want the rune really any closer to figuring out how the hell I'm lost. How the hell I got to those shadows. <laughs> and I still don't think I'm fully done exploring the town. Maybe I am. I did the bridge and then I went back. But I didn't re-explore the bottom part. really what else I could have missed though like how much more I could have missed <laughs> all right guys I am going to stop there uh obviously I did not get back to the shadows but I did like a mini boss thing <laughs> I think yes I've got <laughs> I uh, definitely want to know more about the lore of her because I thought she was one of those aliens since I got the blood from her, but then I just fought her. So I don't know if that's really her or if that's like an imposter or what's going on there. But I am just so intrigued by this lore and also so confused. Like, where are we going with this? Where are we going with this? How do we start with beasts and werewolves? And now all of a sudden we're talking aliens. <laughs> Like, what? what is happening? Um, so definitely curious to, to learn more about this lore, because I am, at this present moment, impeccably confused. Um, thank you guys for bearing with me as I kind of, like, backtracked and re-explored previous areas. Next video, I might go back to the town again to just make sure I got everything there, because, like I said, I didn't actually, like, re-go through that bottom area. I kind of did the top one. Um, and I think that, like, the bridge, like, I think that's kind of it. Like, the area that went to Yosefka's, like, the back tunnel. I still have that down there to explore. Now that I have some antidote, I can do that. I don't know if I'm going to feel like doing that next video, but I have to go back there because I'm sure there's stuff there that I missed. Um, with, like, the giants and the poison water. But then I think we're pretty pretty good. So I think next video, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back to the snake area. <sighs> take my time with that more. Hopefully get back to the shadows and take them on again next video. Uh, so next video will kind of be a little bit of the same. But it will be the snake area that I'm re-going through. Hopefully I can just slow down a bit. Now that I know what to expect, I can slow down a bit, panic less, and pay attention more to, like, the offshoots and the different areas that I can go. The other thing I'm thinking is there was another, um, in that windmilly thing, I think there was a, an elevator there that went to that lower section of the snake area, like, where the aliens were. So I'm thinking that maybe I'll start there, and I'll kind of work that way, and then go up and around, um, because I think the bosses were over there. So maybe I can start start down there. Like the elevator from um, the windmill -y thing. I don't even know what's a windmill. That's just what I keep calling it. But um, where I found that cannibal guy. 
and then I'll kind of work my way backwards because that, that area definitely needs to be explored some more. So that will be next video. Um, and hopefully I find the shadows again. Uh, but thank you guys for being patient with me as I redo this because I want to make sure that I'm getting everything that I can get. Uh, and it did sit right with me that I was just rushing through things. And clearly, I'm glad that I went back because I definitely missed a lot. So um, as always, I appreciate your support and your um, your just willingness to let me explore and struggle and figure things out. That's it's It's been great. Uh, definitely had a lot of fun with this and I hope you do too. <laughs> if you enjoyed it, please make sure you subscribe to the channel. Hit that bell button when you do so that you know when I post my next video. And as always, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it and I hope you have an amazing day.